you know, if there's another stick bait out there and it's new, I've got to try it. Right now, we're going to look at the Yamamoto Baits Floating Slinko and see if it's worth it. If you like this kind of content, please hit that subscribe button. Also, leave me a comment and tell me that you sub so I can say hello and welcome you to the team. You know, if there's a new stickworm, your boy has got to get some and try them out. New from Yamamoto Baits is the Slinko. The Slinko is a five and a half inch floating, heavily ribbed stickworm that has a bunch of ways it can be fished. The Slinko has that normal stickworm shape, but the ribs are meant to trap air, then release and create a bubble trail as it moves. The Slinko uses Yamamoto's Mega Floater formula, which allows the tail to stand up vertically when rigged on jigs, shaky heads, Ned, and Nico rigs. And if you love Carolina rigged fishing, the Slinko will float off the bottom and stay in that special water column you're fishing. The Yamamoto Slinko is five and a half inches in length, comes in seven pieces per pack, and 18 colors. Retail price is $7.99. So I'm gonna keep it real. I had one issue with this bait. When fishing in heavy grass and weeds, I found the grass stayed in between the ribs and I had to remove it almost every cast. And it made me crazy. But it is winter time now and the grass is dying, but I just had to keep it real. For more information or to purchase some on my Tackle Warehouse affiliate, please see the link in the description below. I know, you wanna know how durable it is. It's not bad, it really is not bad, I'm surprised. Other than it catching a lot of weeds, I'm gonna be using a lot of these. So are you gonna buy yourself some? Comment below and tell me what you think. Remember, take a kid fishing, get your fish on. We'll see y'all soon. Cheers.